Tasker now has two new options in the Notify action. These options are Live Update and Short Critical Text. If you usually, if you create a notification like normally, you get an icon here, and then when you expand this, you get to see the full notification. But now, we'll, with Live Update, if you enable this, you get a different notification when Tasker is not in the foreground. So if you if Tasker is in the foreground, it still looks like this. But if Tasker is not in the foreground, it looks like this, a small chip. And when you turn off the screen, the notification will show in full here instead of showing just a small icon. So this is a live update notification. Additionally, you can also set the uh, short critical text, which can be um, any small text up to seven characters, and it'll show up near the near the chip. If you if Tasker is not the foreground app, it show like this. So now you can, for example. Have a, a weather with a weather noti weather notification with the current weather, or anything else you'd like. And again, if you turn off your screen, it shows up like this. So this is the live updates and short notification text, short critical text. Additionally, I've changed the the notification. Uh, behavior on Android 16 because previously when you created uh, uh, multiple notifications by Tasker like this for in this example I'm creating five notifications and if you did this Android would automatically group them all in the same group now there's a new option in the notification action which is group and if you don't set it it'll show up like before, all of the notifications in their own little groups. But if you do set it, like in this example, uh, group one, this notification has first group, so this is a loop. Let me just run this again. This is a loop that runs five times and creates five ungrouped notifications and five group notifications in which the group is called first group. So let's run this. As you can see, it creates two notifications, then three, then four. And all of these are ungrouped, and all of these are in the same group. And you can create as many groups as you want. In this example, I've added group two uh, called second group. So it will should create five ungrouped notifications, five five in group one and another five in group two let's see how it looks like and there it is five in group one five in group two and five ungrouped so now you can finally get the same behavior as you had on android 15 and below so these are the new notification groups and notification live updates in Tasker. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye.